listen guys there are some things that are mandatory in life there is no way around paying taxes there is no way around death and there is certainly no way around having at least one fight in school. I'm not talking about an argument, I am talking about a real fight, a real fist fight. If you never had one, you at least, at least have seen one unfolding right in front of you. You walk down the school hallway thinking it's a regular ass day, you're getting ready for history class and boom. There it is. The sneaker squeaking sound pops up somewhere nearby. A crowd starts to form in a circular shape. And in the midst of that circular shape, there they are. Two divine warriors. Two heroes. Most of the time, two boys throwing haymaker after haymaker at each other. While the crowd is laughing, jumping around and recording the whole thing. Before you can even get a glimpse of the fight, the crowd erupts. While one of the fighters is painfully standing, the other one just lays there, completely still, motionless. Before you could see it, he got knocked the fuck out. In all seriousness though, losing a fight has to be the most painful experience a human being can go through. I know what I'm talking about, I will tell you the story at the end of this video. Especially if it's a school fight. All the baddies, all the boys, the girl you wanted to impress in PE with your basketball skills even though she doesn't give a flying fuck. They are all watching. There is so much on the line. And if you still manage to lose, you have seen the lowest point of life. There is nothing that can scare you after losing a fight. You have been through hell and back. Imagine getting knocked out in front of a big crowd and you wake up after a 10 second slumber. Not to a referee asking you if you're alright. Not to a nurse giving you medicine. Definitely not to a nurse. But you wake up to 20 motherfuckers recording your face with the flash on. School fights are the most unforgiving thing in existence. If you lose one, it is cemented into history. I am 99.9% .9 sure every school fight that has ever happened on this planet has been recorded. Oh, forgot your phone? Don't worry, Melvin got his laptop. He can film the fight. But there's also good news for you. Most of the time, these videos are worsely directed than the average Lazy Town episode. It is safe to say UFO videos and school fights got the worst cameramans in history. It's either A, the quality of the video, meaning the video was recorded in 4 FPS or B, the cameraman for some reason decides to get a seizure mid-fight shaking throughout the whole thing. I have never seen a school fight that was properly recorded. I personally believe it is not even possible, at least in this universe, if there is a multiverse, maybe in some other universe. But in this universe, nah man, no, no, no shot. So we talked about school fights being probably the worst thing in existence, but what if I tell you you can even subdivide and rank school fight arenas? A fight in the parking lot is not as bad as a fight in the classroom. Less space, more obstacles, and all in all just a way more dangerous environment. But if you're really, really unlucky, you have to fight in the underworld. The worst place a human being can fight in. If the odds are against you, you have to fight in the school bathroom. And trust me when I say no one. No human being on this planet wants to fight in a bathroom. Literally, no space. You can't even dodge a fist. You, you can't do shit. And if you end up getting knocked the fuck out, there are plenty of obstacles to hit your head on. And obviously the worst thing, it smells like shit. If I get knocked out, I want to smell some nice air, some nice flowers. Not fucking diarrhea, man. Thank God I never had to fight in a school bathroom, bro. So let me quickly tell you the story of how I lost my first fight. I remember it was 2012. I just got into middle school and trust me when I tell you, I was really looking for smoke when I was younger. Literally, my dad had to pick me up every other week because I got into some senseless fight. I really thought I was the strongest human being on this planet back in the day. It was recess and some kids were playing some type of game in the school hallway. I don't really remember correctly what it was. If I had to put my finger on it, I would say they were trading Pokemon cards. And me being interested as fuck, to this day, I love Pokemon. Pokemon is my life. I walked up to the kids and I kid you not, I was just standing there booling, not saying a single word. I wasn't even being annoying. I think they were four people and one of those motherfuckers all of a sudden tells me to basically fuck off when I was just watching. I wasn't doing anything. And me being me back in the day, I was steaming. Instantly, I started cursing him out, trying to fight. So one of the four guys stood up and damn, he was towering me. He was at least a whole head bigger than me. And he was fat as fuck. So we instantly got into it and I swear to God to this day all my friends think I got beaten the fuck up by some fat dude because at the end of the day I lost the fight. But picture this guys, I got this motherfucker in a headlock, a really really tight headlock. Headlock was my go-to move back in the day. 
I got him in a headlock and I want to throw him to the ground. But just in that moment, and I still don't know how that shit happened. Maybe I slipped. I have no idea. But instead of only throwing him to the ground, I threw myself to the ground first. Listen, my nose hit the fucking ground so fucking hard. Right there on the spot, I broke it. My nose was covered in blood. The school hallway was covered in blood drops. It looked like a fucking crime scene. And this fat motherfucker even claimed that I broke his foot the next day, bro. To this day, I think that was some phony shit he tried to get me into trouble. But yeah, the principal wasn't buying it, so yeah. Listen, guys, if you have any fight stories, leave them down in the comment section below. I really want to hear your stories. And listen, I, this is not me promoting fights, but I would rather fight with my fists instead of pulling up to a fight with a knife or, or a gun. Like, that's some pussy shit. If you have to fight, fight, but try to solve the issue in a different way because fighting should be the last option. So it's been your boy, guys. If you liked the video, leave a like. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to subscribe. Other than that, I'm out. Peace.